you know, it's it's coming to my attention that I have been I've got to come clean. I'm not really a Purdue fan. Like, I'm just going to put on my my regular shirt that is not a Xander Horvath uh, throwback jersey. Uh, yeah, guys, like, I'm really not that big of a Purdue fan. I'm just not really that big of a Purdue fan. Like, you guys, you, you caught me when I mispronounced um, some names in a video. And you guys caught me. It's unfortunate that I, after all these years of making videos and, you know, this picture of six-year-old me at a Purdue football game is unfortunately an altered photo that actually didn't take place along with these videos of me at Purdue sporting events. staged and taken by somebody else along with all these other pictures that I'm going to show of me at Purdue football and basketball games over the years. Unfortunately those did not actually happen. You know, I know I'm like the, the Richard Nixon of college sports fans now. It's unfortunate as I sit on my bed with Purdue pillow covers and definitely not a Purdue comforter. Let me actually have to change outfits really quick. Because, like, this, I don't really wear this stuff. Like, this isn't really actual stuff that I wear on a day to day basis. I'm sorry. So, yeah, guys, um, after I get on what I actually wear, give me a second here. Definitely not a Carson Edwards jersey who is definitely not my favorite college basketball player of all time. I just want to show you guys something. At no point in time did I ever stand in line and get Zach Eadie's autograph. If y'all can make sure y'all can see that. I did not stand in line. There's not a picture of me standing in line waiting for Zach Eadie's autograph. These also didn't happen. None of these happened. I did not go to Mackey Arena on that day. I'm definitely not wearing a Chris Jefferson Purdue football jersey right now. And there was also never a time on Twitter when me and a Miami Heat fan got in a fight and I was edited with this hat on with a picture with a caption that said cry. I never purchased this Purdue poster at a book fair in 8th grade. Didn't happen, guys. And this is not... A Caleb First Elf poster. It's just not. I don't even if you see it. And these are not Purdue sweatpants that were purchased at Meyer. They're just not. Along with that, this Jade and Ivy T-shirt. I don't have it. This Zach Eady shirt. I don't have it. This Spoiler Makers hoodie. Commemorating our October 1st win over ranked Minnesota. I didn't really get it. This Purdue shirt. Also, don't have it. Don't have this. Don't. Don't own that. Don't have that shirt either. I mean, a lot of my wardrobe just doesn't exist, guys. It's unfortunate. You guys see all these jerseys? I mean, this Braden Smith jersey. 
It's Lance Jones jersey. Also, I mean, everybody has a Zach Eady jersey, right? A Devin Mockaby jersey. Everyone has this. Keedron Jenkins jersey. Everyone's got it, man. And this Jack Ansel jersey. Unfortunately, I don't really own this. So yeah, guys, to make a, a long story short, I'm just not really a Purdue fan. You caught me. Out, COVID. And now a hole opens up and more for Horvath than a hurdle. Mike Allstott never did that.